Hello and welcome back. I've treated myself to a die holder, more taper free and has various adapters as well so you can put bigger dies in. This is an M10 for a job I'm doing at the moment and the idea is it keeps it parallel to the lathe axis so it doesn't run off so you get a wonky thread. So the first time I've tried it so I'll see how we get on. It looks about right there and I'll zoom in so you can see the action. There we go. That's quite easy actually. Like a walk in the park. Oh dear. That wasn't. So let's get over from the gearing, stop the head moving. Did you see I was pretty prepared really, weren't I? Not. So let's see what we got after all that. Yeah, there you go. One thread. This hopefully should fit this manifold I've been making for the model steam engine. And it does. And this is my favourite part of the video. Job done. I needed to blank the end on this tube, but it will start off as a solid bar, but I've drilled all the way down it to last quarter of an inch, and it's going to form a manifold. It's going to have four pipes in it, and a pipe to the boiler, and it's going to form one side of a steam engine I'm building at the moment. But after drilling, I need to blank the end off, and that's what I've done. And that's the threaded blank using the die holder. It's turned it rather well. So I'm happy with that. So those of interest to you. Thank you very much.